It took a lot of work to get to this moment and a lot of minds to make CFG Bank Arena what it is. And part of the idea was to have diverse minds. That goes all the way to the architects involved in this project. 11 TV Hill contributor Brianna Ross has that story. Derek Adams has spent quite a bit of time forming quite a few memories within these walls. I saw the Jackson 5 here when I was maybe five, five or six years old. I saw the Baltimore Clippers here. As many circuses as I've come to, as many Disney on ice as I've come to, and everything else in between, I would have never thought that I would have had this possibility, this opportunity. The opportunity to renovate, redesign, and reimagine what is now the CFG Bank Arena. Adams is a Baltimore native who owns his own architecture firm. His involvement with the project started with a cold call. A firm in Canada selected his firm, Adams Design Group, to help with the project. I danced. <laughs> I mean, it was, I couldn't believe it, uh, first of all, and because I hadn't, because it was just out of nowhere, you know, and it was like, how did they find out who we were. When we look at big projects like this, how important do you think it is that we see that diversity and that representation in the folks that help bring it to life? A lot. Um, I think one of the things that we, we talk about, we talk about it all the time, but it rarely ever happens. But it happened for Adams. He helped transform the arena with new suites, lounges, and setups fit for A-list artists. It was a team effort alongside several other black-owned businesses but his was the only black architecture firm on the job. About two, two to three percent of all licensed architects in, in the United States are African American. Even fewer own their own practices. And so I guess I'm in some ways a double unicorn. A double unicorn who wants to inspire other black architects and leave his mark on the city he loves. For me as an architect, I always think about legacy. How can I leave my footprint or how can I leave my thumbprint on something beyond my being here, and this is one of them. Brianna, join us now. Adams is an excited man right now. This place was completely different last year. That's right. So they were excited just that it was able to be open for the CIAA right. tournament with the timeline of everything. So they were able to have the tournament here. But of course, all the amenities you see today, everything wasn't quite ready last year. There were some spaces that were still closed off and still being worked on. But this is the first year that everything is open yeah. in time for CIAA tournament. And so he's just really excited for everyone to see, you know, those suites, the, the levels that weren't available last year all that CFG Bank Arena now has to offer. It's going to be fun. Yeah. All right, Brianna, thank you. <laughs>